Hello agents, in this video I'm going to show you how to get the Diamondback Exotic Rifle on the Division 2 and you get it from the Kenley College Expedition, you can see that on screen now, you just got to fast travel there and complete that expedition to get the Exotic Rifle. However, you do need to be aware that this is a timed event, so uh, you've actually at this moment in time got until the 13th of August to get hold of this exotic rifle, after then they say it will not be back until later in the year. So whether you can't do the expedition or whether it just removes the chance of getting the diamond back, I'm not sure. Uh, but you've only got to the 13th right now to get a guys to get on the expedition and get it complete. On screen now is the map of Kenley College. You can see that the libraries on the right you've got um, just up north is the student union and south is the metro. To the left there is the kind of special area that you'll get access to once the other three areas are completed. Also in Kenley College there is uh, 11 collectibles to get and free backpack trophies. I've got these covered. Do check the video description out for links to these videos. At the start of each area, you will need to interact with an echo, which will give you three figures which you can investigate. Each one's like a puzzle. You're going to be killing a lot of ads, defending stuff, figuring out miniature puzzles, which are very easy. Uh, we're actually showing you now on screen the library. You see that yellow valve in front of me? That's used at some point. This wire I'm following now is something I've got to use to search for what the uh, objective is in the top left corner. Uh, there's little junction boxes like this uh, yellow box I just shoot now to open doors. That sort of thing, it's nothing too difficult. The library is very easy, so we're just going to move on to the metro. So this is right at the start of the metro now. I thought I'd show you the echo, so you can see that here. I just need to activate it, and then I get the three figures to choose from. You need to do each one of these, uh, but you can do them in any order. Uh, and it's exactly the same with the metro, guys. It's not really much more advanced. There's a lot of killing ads. There's following wires. There's hitting switches and figuring that out. Uh, I don't think there's any more help you're going to need. On screen now, I'm actually showing you the location of the backpack trophy, so I'll let this roll uh, if you want to follow this route to get this. But remember, I've got links in the description to cover all of these, uh, the hidden loot rooms and all collectibles. The only puzzle in the metro that may um, keep you for a few minutes is this one here with the valves. You're required to hit three switches. So you turn this valve and then you've got to hit three. Just notice the backgrounds of the switches. You'll see now I'm going to point one out on screen that has no like background to it. It's uh, just a fix to that, nothing special. But this switch here has a hazard background, the black and yellow. You just hit the three switches with the hazard background and you're, and you're golden. Moving on to the student union, this is the third and final area that you need to complete in order to unlock the fourth area for the Diamondback Exotic Rifle. It's the most fun I had on the expedition, I thought the student union, um, it was just more fun to play. Like for example now on screen, the only way you can damage these bosses is with flames, so they're immune to everything except flame, which means you need the flame grenade, you need your flame turret, or you just see now I shot that black crate, they do head over to them, which uh, is quite convenient. On another mission in the student union, you'll also be uh, tracing blood on the floor back to a body in a refrigerator to find a key. Uh, but all in all, this student union is easy as well. There's nothing too difficult, nothing that should keep you more than a few minutes if you're working out with your friend. Once you have completed the library, the metro and the student union, you can head to this building over here. And just to the left and down the side is how you gain entry to this, not this door here. And once you gain entry, you'll have a chest which will have the Diamondback exotic rifle in it. So it's just this entry to the left here where you'll be able to interact with the door to unlock it. Um, we'll show you the Diamondback on screen now so you can have a look at it. If this video has helped, please do hit the like button. We'd really appreciate it. And also check out my video description again for the links to the collection collectibles that are in this expedition, uh, backpack trophies as well, and also the hidden loot rooms. And remember, this is a time-sensitive reward. I'm not sure whether the expedition is going to be taken off after the 13th of, 13th of August, sorry, or whether the Diamondback is just not going to drop. I'm sure we'll find out. It will be coming back later in the year, though, so if you're watching this and it's already too late, you will be able to get a chance again. Uh, again, thank you for watching this video. Do hit like if, it's, if you've liked it. Uh, click subscribe for more content. And do check out the video description for our link to our community as well. It's a great place to be. You're very welcome to come and join us. It'll be good to see you there. Until the next video thank you for watching this one and peace out